Now, here's how you can install offline Google Maps on your iPhone. Well, it doesn't work like you have a separate application. You know, it's still within the Google Maps, so you don't have to download anything new. What you have to do is to make sure you get inside of the app and in here, just locate the, this like main explore page because you might be somewhere in here. Call to explore and click on your name or profile picture right here. Once you do get into this section, tap on offline maps. And the way that it works is that I already have some downloaded maps from these like dates. They do actually expire in a year from the creation date. That is because you need to update them. But essentially, to create or save a new map for offline use, click on this at the top. And this rectangle is going to pop up. Essentially, you can choose what gets inside of this rectangle and what is inside is going to be saved and downloaded for offline use. So you can zoom it out. You can fit a lot more. You know, you can keep on zooming, but obviously it's not going to fit it to like uh, install or download an entire world. So it is going to just get smaller when you go like this. You can see that this is the maximum you can download, but it is still pretty good. So when you get inside, usually you only need to download like a few neighborhoods or like cities. So this is pretty good. Once you're happy, you just click on a download and then it's going to show up as one of these pages right here, which is, you know, a map from a different city, which I can keep track on and I can get to even without the internet. An important thing to know is that sometimes it is kind of important to update it to make sure you have the latest streets and in case something changes on a map, make sure to keep it up to date just so you know you have the latest version of that app. But that is essentially how you can use it. So hope you found this video helpful. Hit a thumbs up, subscribe below. I'm going to catch you in the next video.